gentlemen can we appreciate the general Lulu cultural troop Chaluki with a round of applause. Following the Zilian cultural troop, we have from Ekrani Patar village representing the girls of Nagaland. This morning, the girls of Nagaland will be demonstrating for us a traditional ritual called Rugala. Rugala is a ritual practiced by the ancient Archics of the Garos. Nukapana, Diamdina, Rabugana, Nangapana, Prasina, Karuna, Kurunatuna, Atiatuna, Nishi Sajun, Skandapa, Garuna, Patipa, Oma, Nerman, Achikna, Katara, Isusna, Rugala, Ichin Tingen, Tama Tingen, Akaru Tingen, this is the priest. He is pronouncing the prayers and he is saying that this ritual is performed to please the sun god Missy Saljong. The Rugala ritual. Yako Ichen Nibagana. Deva Eko Tamrimia Tamripanti. The Rugala ritual is a ritual that is practiced as a thanksgiving to the sun god. The priest who performs the ritual. Also predicts the future, the fortune of the people. Chatanamagnaja, and then in Giraja, Chatakawarini, 
It is believed that through this ritual, the priest is able to predict if the people will have a rich harvest or suffer a poor. <laughs> Hai gram chakatna dumaja dong kanaro chambalaki koto o chakobishi kanaro Salama di nabagen salama ko pichugen uri badi bagen aku dalan katsugen after all the rituals are done, every person in the community is blessed. Is blessed. It is said that after the ritual, the people start dancing and singing. It is led by the priest. อบาลเนี่ยที่กระทั่งมันเรื่องตกกังจอนากาเล่นพันเทเดมีชักมาคนมันทบจอเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ย
Another important feature of this ritual is the use of an egg by the priest. The priest, with all his might, throws the egg on the ground. If the egg is found to be perfect, good fortune is predicted for the people. However, if it's found to be defective, it is believed that they are going to have hardships in future and maybe suffer a famine. Ladies and gentlemen, the Ek Rani Pata village culture troop representing the Garos of Nagaland with their demonstration of a traditional ritual called Rugala. Entering the performing arena from my right, we shall now have the Waziho village cultural troop with an indigenous game of the butcheries in Waziho village. The game is called Te Telote. Te Telote is one of the indigenous games of the Waziho village of the butchery tribe in Nagaland. It is played as a competition and recreational recreational activity during get-together and festive seasons. Usually two or more teams are divided among young boys. Where they choose one runner from among us them and the rest of the team stands together in a pair in line with their hands molded together, as you can see them doing now. The chosen runner from each team will climb up on molded hands of their team members, as you can see, and they will compete to finish first in the race. The fastest to reach the end line is declared the winner. They have to make sure that their hands are noted. We have a winner. And a prize.
ladies and gentlemen, the Waziho Village Cultural Troop with the indigenous game called Te Telote. The Dimasa Kachori Cultural Troop now will now enter the performing arena by Kon or by Jubu is a serpent dance of the Dimasas of the Kachori tribe. This dance is performed by both men and women. You will notice the dancers move around in twisting and winding rows, imitating the crawling python. It is a popular dance performed on all festive occasions like the Ghost Harvest Festival of the Kachoris called Pushu, or marriage ceremonies and other happy occasions. Ladies and gentlemen, the Dimasa Kachari cultural trip with Pai Kon or Pai Chobu.
the truth. Just remember to us the seven dance calls Pai Kong or Pai Judo. Before we move on to the next performance, I am truly ble blessed and pleased to announce that we have two beauty queens of North East in our presence, in our midst to this morning, accompanied by two Miss Nagalan. I would like to introduce to them as they take the performing arena, as they walk into the performing arena. First, we have Irene, Irene Takar, the reigning Miss Notice 2022. She is from Mekhalaya, ladies and gentlemen. Next, we have Ishani Hatimuria, the first runner-up of Miss Notice. She is from Assam. They are accompanied by Novi Awumi, Femina Miss India Nagaland 2022, and Awumi Kovong, the reigning Miss Nagaland 2021. As we all know that the Miss Nagaland will be held this evening. We are truly blessed and honored to have the four of you to grace this occasion. Thank you so much. Performing for you next, we have the Ethnic Performing Arts from Dimapu representing the Sumi tribe of Nagaland. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this morning the Ethnic Performing Arts will be demonstrating for you Aku Kutsu Kii, which is the head hunting. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is a dramatized sequence of warriors displaying how they would go into the enemy's territory. It was common for the Nagas to be warring against their neighbors or even between the different tribes. Usually, when they take part When an enemy is slain, the head is taken as
taking the head of an enemy actually entitles you to be a true head hunter of the Nagas. After the head is taken, usually the triumphant warriors would celebrate their victory with the trophy ahead as their trophy they would walk home Ladies and gentlemen, the ethnic performing arts from Dimapu representing the Sumi tribe of Nagaland with their demonstration of the head hunting or Aku Katsuki. Performing for you next, we have the Yachomaro cultural troupe from Kohima representing the Lothar tribe of Nagaland. You are my God. There is nobody. Your mercy have protected me. This is my song to you and I lift up my hands and praise you. Praise his name, everybody. Let's praise our Lord. Ladies and gentlemen, the song of praise called Tang Tang Ken by the Yachumaru Cultural Troupe Kohima, representing the Lota tribe of Naglin.
The Yet Tomorrow cultural troupe from Kohima with their performance of a song of praise called Tang Tang Ken. Entering the arena, we have from Kikwema village representing the Angami tribe of Nagaland. Today, the Kikuma Village Cultural Troupe will be performing for us another song of praise. The title of this song can be roughly translated to The Ancients Abode. The bird sings their hymns, the hills lend its bait while men and the women folk toil the land. The rains gently touch and turn the field. The fields go golden. The gold symbolizing prosperity and worm. This is the ancient land and it thrives.
from Kikuma village representing the Angami tribe of Nagaland with their performance of a folk song of praise. Tsumwemo is a pre-harvest festival of the Aonaga tribe in Nagaland. On the eve of the harvest, during the time of our forefathers, this festival used to be held for six days, marking the end of vicarious plantation, besides nursing the better fields, followed by sacrificial offerings. Our forefathers celebrated the festival in Grandier with songs, dances, merrymaking, and feasting. It is a festival seeking blessings from God for a good harvest and is also a festival of thanksgiving. Ladies and gentlemen, the Culture Club Kansa from Mogokchung District, representing the Aonaga tribe in Nagaland, will do an enactment of the Tsumomo evening when young unmarried men and women gather in the village ready to begin the celebration that involves singing, dancing and visiting houses till late in the night. They used to convey messages through songs and their conversations usually will be in songs. So the summary of the songs are as follows. The boys will be saying, Oh, we are returning from the far southeast. We are returning like waterfall birds, like visitors from the end of the world. And the girls will respond, From the far away place, enemies are coming. All the villagers be prepared to face the battle. Our men folk have completely defeated the enemies from afar and also those coming from behind the great ocean and the unknown world. The warriors from the king's palace retreated with tears after losing the battle and regret their reached fortune. song, the man posed a question to his beloved as to whether she would remember him if he is killed in the battle.
has invited, uh, invited the young boys to celebrate with drinks and meat. They are singing songs about inviting friends who have not joined and asking them, have you lost your loved one or admirer? Do not mourn, come and join us in the celebration. And they reply, I have not lost my loved one. I am not interested to be a part of the celebration. Just spending my time idly like the wild bird that is seated on the branch of a thick forest tree, enjoying the song of waterfall. Ladies and gentlemen, this is an enactment of the Zalama Festival, where the men folk spend time together through the late nights. Gentlemen, the Culture Club Kansa from the Owl Tribe. Ladies and gentlemen, with the exit of the Culture Club Kansa, representing the Aal tribe of Nagaland, we have come to the end of the morning session of the culture program themed Cultural Connect, brought to you by the Department of Art and Culture, Government of Nagaland, in collaboration with the Department of Tourism, Government of Nagalin. Cultural Troops, Morombra Sop Mano Karaguna Halagruwo. Ladies and gentlemen, we thank you for joining us this morning. We also request you to join us again for the afternoon session of the cultural program, which begins at 1 p.m. We shall witness in the afternoon eight performances from the Angami Cultural Troupe, represented by the Kezoma Village, followed by Kuki Cultural Troupe, Chakisan Cultural Troupe, Ao Cultural Troupe, Rengma Cultural Troupe, Lota Cultural Troupe, Puchuri Cultural Troupe, and culminating with the performances from the Sumi Cultural Troupe.
We also have an announcement a sight of an earring, white, black, and red in color, has been found from the arena. I repeat, an earring has been found from the arena. It's white, black, and red in color. If you are the owner of this earring, kindly come and collect it from the announcing booth. Yate ekta kapor janai divo, earring ekta paigona ase, puka kala alo lal ase, abnila earring ase koile, moromra yate announcing boot pra yate lovele janai di ase. With this, we have come to the end of our live broadcast. Thank you for watching Hornbill TV and stay tuned for more news and updates. Kali langa bacha or adolescent kan traditional or notun forms of digital media de bishi immersed hui jaise. To sal majo de moi kan dikhi pai ki digital media use to moi kan para interactions or social media karne chulai. Especially aji kali langa bacha kan para digital media easily access kuro bo pare. 
evidence kan ko yase ki idu digital media exposure para bacha kan ki early learnings nutun ideas laga exposure knowledge or social contact laga support pai itu technology laga fast changing pace para bacha kan desktop computer laga botli digital tablets or smartphones kan hi chulai shuru hoyse ajikali digital media laga cons para pros to outweigh kridi she aro itu laga negative impact to health aro learning attention bi a kridi she especially bacha kan inappropriate aro unsafe content kan easily access krubo pare bacha kan do tai kan chutu thagya time de para parents para mold kridi bole lage tai kan laga bright future karne technology providers kan para parents ke modot krubo le karne kids profile bi offer kriya se huli bi information easily accessible hua para पचा कांदो इतु किड्स प्रोफाइल पर किनिका हाती बुले बिशी जोती हिके आसे पेरेंट्स कान पर बच्चा कांदो एंगेज क्रीगिना थागेबो कारने स्मार्टफोन्स कान प्रोवाइड करे होली बी साइले दो इतु हैबिट पर बच्चा दो ओलप तंग होली दो फोन ना थागेले बॉय बो ना पारे इतु कारने पेरेंट्स कान केयरफुली डिसाइड करबो लागे बच्चा कान के टेक्नोलॉजी पर डिस्ट्रैक्ट करबो ना ह्यूमन अटेंशन पर डिस्ट्रैक्ट करबो अलग होता दो फोन दे बिशी सादो आजकली लगा बच्चा कान लगा सुकुदो चुतु परा ही जोड़ी बिया होए असे अरो आजकली लगा प्लेग्राउंड्स कान दो बिशी खाली असे किले कोले बच्चा कान दो स्मार्टफोन दे ही थागे अरो लेस इंटरैक्टिव होए जाएगी ना ताई कान लगा पीयर्स कान लोगों दे ना मिले होए जाएँगे पेंडेमिक कारने पेरेंट्स का लोग और ऑप्शन भी ना थके हुए जाएंगे कि ले कोई ले स्कूल्स का सब ऑनलाइन सेक्टर आ ही जाएंगे और बच्चा कांगे फोन दिवो ले उपाय ना थके हुए जाएंगे पेरेंट्स का बच्चा ऑनलाइन क्लास लो आता है मुझे बच्चा कांग लोगों दे थके वो ना पड़े तो इतु करने पेरेंट्स कांग � टेक्नोलॉजी तो थगे बोले ही ऐसे इतु कारणे पेरेंट्स कान सब बोली लगे कि ताई लगा बच्चा दो वेब पर आके एक्सेस करो बो पार बो और कुन दो ना पार बो पेरेंट्स कान बुझ बोले लगे कि टेक्नोलॉजी तो बच्चा लगा डेवलपमेंट करने बाल ऐसे होली भी एक ता बैलेंस पर इतु टेक्नोलॉजी तो चला बो है कि बोले दिव Hello and welcome, I'm Paula Misen and you're watching Hornbill TV. Now the news in headlines. The Rajya Sabha passed the Wildlife Protection Amendment Bill 2022 on Thursday. The bill intends to amend the Wildlife Protection Act 1972 to incorporate more species protected under the law. Five people died and over 60 were injured in a fire caused by a cylinder explosion in the village in the Jodhpur district of Rajasthan on Thursday afternoon. According to reports, the incident occurred at a house in Shergar subdivision's Bhumra village where guests had gathered for a wedding. Former Chief Minister of Maharashtra and Shiv Sena UBT President Uddhav Thakre on Thursday targeted the BJP saying that just the way big ticket projects were shifted from Maharashtra to Gujarat ahead of the assembly polls there, villages from the state could be merged into Karnataka where elections are due next year. A self-styled cadre of a banned terrorist organization, Liberation Tigers of Tribals, LTT, was arrested on Thursday after a special operation was carried out by the Kachar police in Harinagar areas under Joypur police station of Kachar district in Assam. Now the news in detail. Former Chief Minister of Maharashtra and Shiv Sena UBT President Uddhav Thakre on Thursday targeted the BJP saying that just the way big ticket projects were shifted from Maharashtra to Gujarat ahead of the assembly polls there, villages from the state could be merged into Karnataka where elections are due next year. He said that the shifting of the projects to Gujarat from Maharashtra earlier this year played a major role in the Bharatiya Janata Party's resounding victory in the neighboring state Gujarat. कि गेल्या वेळेला या तीन निवडणुका ज्या झाल्या होत्या एक दिल्ली महापालिका हिमाचल आणि गुजरात या तिन्ही ठिकाणी 
भारतीय जनता पक्ष जिंक होता यावेला मात्र दिल्ली में आप जिंक है हिमाचल में कांग्रेस जिंक है आ गुजरात में भारतीय जनता पक्षा ने अभूतपूर्व यश मिल यशाबल जे यशा मानकारी अभिनंदन तो आम्मी स करो आहोत गोष को लक्षा घी पाइजे कि गुजरात विजया मधे महाराष्ट्र पड़वे उद्योग योगदान है को विसरू नए मे एक बाजूला महाराष्ट्र ओरबाड़ा अपने इप्सित जे है तो साध्य कराए मन आम जी भीति वाटते कि गुजरात निवणुका डोसमोर महाराष्ट्र उद्योग जसे पड़वले तसच कर्नाटक की निवूक डोसमोर महाराष्ट्र गाव सुधा तोड़ी कि भीति निर्माण है A self-styled cadre of a banned terrorist organization, Liberation Tigers of Tribals (LTT), was arrested on Thursday after a special operation was carried out by the Kachar Police in Hari Nagar areas under Joypur Police Station of Kachar District in Assam. The arrested cadre was identified as Semin Thang, alias Alex Gangte, aged 28 years, and a resident of Jinam Ghat of Dimahasau. This outfit was formed in 2018 and since then cadres were involved in kidnapping killing illegal tax collection etc recently 12 cadres of this outfit including their chairman and deputy chairman surrendered before the chief minister of Manipur N Birain Singh on 29th July 2022 last Gupon Hutor Pomkhedi aji eta ami bikhek obhijan arambha koru Joypur anchalot aru tat निषिध घोषित एल टी टी लिबारेशन टाइगार्स अफ ट्राइबल तर एज स्वयंभू मानने सदस्य नाम हल सेमेथांग एलियास एलेक्स गेंगटे संगठन सदस्य नाइन एम एम पिस्टल पा गई से और एमिनेशन पा गई से गति के ये अंचल हरिनगर अंचल अभियान धरा पड़े और ये अभियान करायत्त करोधपोष कर आम गम पा मते अंचल किसुसंख्यक लोक और 